And if we don't even talk about plastic surgery, I was telling my sister in Korea, everyone, I think everyone knows that Korea is pretty popular plastic surgery. There is people don't hide it or anything. But the trends for plastic surgery they change with time. So pretty like fast. That, pretty fast. And I wonder those people who go through the knife, what they think when it's out of trend, their face again. They go and redo the thing. I don't know. Imagine my face is not fashionable now. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> but that happens. It's like in the past was the V line. So have the face like this, very tiny, and no no jawline for women, no apple of the cheek, because I mean in the United States they apply fillers in the cheekbones to make you look like, I don't know, more the muscles go up and you look younger, they think. But in Korea, because people naturally have a higher cheekbone, they think it's too much. So sometimes they even break this bone to make it slimmer. And yeah, so there is like lip filler. And I was telling nose as well, fixing. And I told my sister, nowadays they are even doing something to lift the corners of the mouth. It looks like a little cat. And I'm like, <laughs> interesting. I've, I've never seen this. Never seen this. And there is a double eyelid. You can redo a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. So, and there is injections for your legs to make them slimmer. So the muscle shrinks. Really? Yeah. Really. Because this cough part here is when it's big, it's ugly. In other places of the world, they would say if it's big, it's pretty because you have muscles. Here, if you have muscles, you're ugly. So, you put an injection, it shrinks, and you have slim legs, chopstick legs. And wow. so many different things. <laughs> I mean, how, how can people be convinced that your body is not good enough and, you know, be convinced that you need a surgery? Not because of your health, but because of your beauty. It's really about yeah. self-esteem, I guess, you know. Your, the whole system and advertisements and all that, they mess up your self-confidence so much that you truly believe that you're ugly and you need this to survive. I mean, it's so wrong, so wrong. 